Hello everybody, it is Aiden. We are here today with the Electro Bulb Swift Dream Mod, and we are going to be going over the healer spells. Let's get right into this. Um, okay. So, let this start with the healer. So there's a decent amount of healer spells, there's a lot of advanced, but uh, let's, let's get started. So, we have, I don't know how to describe this, I do like the look, um, I wish I could add this into, um, Hot Pixel Dungeons, I'm thinking now, because I haven't, honestly, I haven't really touched this in a while, and I've been watching a lot of Hot Pixel Dungeons, because I have loved, like, Skyblock, you know, if anyone knows what that is, I'm not sure, but, uh, it's great, put it on my channel, so, you probably do, but, you know, whatever, um, Really fun game. I wish they added in stuff like this, because that would be absolutely sick, but you know, whatever. Anyway, let us start off with the novice spells. So, I don't know what I just did there. Uh, let us start off the way we always do. Upgrade the wand a little bit. So, let's start off with evade, heal, and ward. Okay, so the first one pushes you to the right and to the left. What's the cooldown for this? Let's just see. So whichever, how do you control it? So if we were up here, we take us this direction. So that could be used as like a like a like a jump feature almost. What's it called? You know? Like if you were like yeah. Or if you were running and you were just like yeah. And then you wanted it to like flip around. You know, that could be interesting. I don't know, but you know, whatever. Uh, the next spell is going to be heal, and I think for this we are gonna have to probably test it from mob. So let's heal first. Um so let's make it night. Actually, no, I don't like night. Night's scary. Uh, let us slash. What do we want to summon? Slash so summon like. Uh, make maybe like a. A zombie. Let's just summon a zombie. So you're doing damage to me. Probably should be wearing armor. This is great, okay. Please don't die. Awesome, you actually didn't die. So we're at one and a half hearts. What are we gonna heal? And click. We heal seven hearts. That's honestly pretty awesome. I do like the animation. And they're coming out with even more animations. Um it's not really an animation, but it's like it's like a texture almost like I don't know. But they are coming out with animations for this mod, so I'm super excited for that to come out. Um, they're also going to be adding a little, like this thing called a bookshelf and a lectern, so you can search for books, which is going to be awesome. And finally, they're adding JEI integration, which is going to be absolutely awesome. But, uh, you know. Neat. This is called Ward. I don't know exactly what it does. So, let us look. Grant the caster shielding effect that reduces incoming magic damage for 30 seconds. So, I'm not going to test this, but basically, let's say there was a wizard, right? Uh, let's say there was a wizard, like an evil wizard, and it was firing spells at you. You'd use ward, and then this, like, let's say, he had, like, the ice, like, the ice lance, and it did 10 damage. It would actually only do 7 damage, because of the 30% uh, debuff. So, um, let us, let's, let's do this. This is... The ex apprentice spells. I did like those. I wish they were slightly more powerful, but I guess they are um, a, uh, novice level spells, so I probably shouldn't be able to use them. So let us. So we started over with. I honestly don't know. Let's just start with our uh, replenish hunger. So yeah, I mean that's pretty cool. It replenishes your hunger. Oh, that's kind of what we expected. This one could be cool. So this one that okay. 
That's really, oh, that's bright, oh my god. Um, this is gonna be awesome, watch this. It just don't do nothing. Come for me, bro. Come for me, bro. You can't get here. Because he's just walking into an invisible wall. I'm gonna switch game modes and let us shield is the slot here. Um, so it's five a second. Eight percent grants weakness. Oh my, how is that not like a better spell? That's really overpowered. Well, I guess it's the force field. Okay. <coughs> we will get to that later. Um, but that's cool. Next is Empowering Essence. And I'm not sure what that is exactly. Um, I have Empowerment 3. Are you serious? Are you kidding? Did I just delete my whole... Okay, well, this is fine. Don't worry, people. We can get this back. Uh, this is annoying. Okay. Um, so let's get our apprentice. We don't need to upgrade, it's fine. Um, so we have shield, then we have invigorating presence, which is here. Uh, grants the caster increased strength for 45 seconds, so we use that. And we get strength 3! I'm just going to show you an example of how powerful this is. Um, Yeah, that's insane. Um, strength 3 is awesome. That's a really powerful thing. Heal ally. I don't know if we're going to be able to test this, but that should be... Heals the target by 2 and a half hearts. So if you're in a battle with someone, you could be like, yeah, yeah, heal you. And there's a person, like, let's say right here. Um, you know, let's say we're healing this thing. Go, cham, and it heals him. By two and a half hearts. Uh, next we have cure effects, which I mean, slash effect. I think it's gonna jerk. Hunger, maybe? It just it gets rid of them. Um, then replenishes hunger shield. Uh, our, then we have three more. Right? Empowering Essence of Christ. We already have done this one. I feel like there was one more before, but I don't know where it is. Maybe not. Yeah, I guess not. Okay. Um, okay, so now we have Oak Flesh, which we can read about right here. Improves the caster's damage resistance for 30 seconds. So, resistance 2 for. So, imagine you had this. And you had. I mean, that would be incredibly overpowered. Okay, so then there's empowering. Um, empowering essence, and that increases magic damage. So if you had the ice lance and you did whatever it is, it's like insane. It's like what is it like sixteen damage? So imagine that. But you do nineteen. 
right? Is that what? Yeah, it would be 19 damage. That's crazy because it's the 60% buff and the 1 plus the 30% off 10. So 19. That's crazy. That's actually insane. Wow, okay. Good spell. Good spells. Good spells, my dude. Um, let us go. I don't have any chests, so I'll just throw them in this one. Let us get on with the advanced spells. And this is where things start to get a little more, like, OP. So we have Crew Peel, Conjure Armor, Arcane Jammer, Transcience, and Iron Flesh. Iron Flesh is, like, super overpowered, but not super positive. So Crew Peel, I'm going to assume... It's basically like a better version of the, the ally heal. Pure heal ally. He heals the caster in all nearby alleys and some creatures by three hearts. So, I mean, it's, it's useful. But let's take armor off for this current conjure armor one. Okay, so it doesn't give you... Oh, that's iron flesh. Okay. Iron flesh gives you res three. Why is this so overpowered? I don't understand. Like, what? That's extraordinarily overpowered. And there's Transcience, which is here. Makes the caster transient every 20 seconds. The caster is immune to all damage, but cannot break, place blocks, or cause damage. Uh oh. So remember the. the, uh. Okay, this is cool. So we can walk around and stuff, and we are completely invincible right now. But we also can't do anything, so nothing can see us. So no, nothing. Oh, is it? Yeah, so nothing can see us. And if we don't hold this one, then we're like almost completely invisible except for these particles. So nothing can see us. We can't do anything. They can't do anything. But it's very good for escaping. So you just do this, and literally no one knows where you are. Or if you were to like throw a smoke bomb, that could be interesting. So let's let's try that actually. So let's say how powerful is this milk bomb? Oh, that's good. Okay. So if you were to be like, yeah, I don't think anybody would know where you are if you could switch. And then you just, you know, like, that would be overpowered. And then no one could see you. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. We have three more seconds of transients. And we're back. Okay, cool. Okay. Conjure armor. Transcends. Um, next is Arcane Jammer. And I don't know what this one does either. Um, prevents the Turk from using magic for 15 seconds. I just found a very good advantage for our battle. Because we're going to do a battle episode where me and a few of my friends are going to battle it out with different with different spells. We're going to do a few different rounds with a few different rules. It's going to be pretty awesome. Make sure you stick around for that. Um, that's going to be pretty sick, I gotta say. Um, then we have Conjure Armor, and this one we're going to take the armor off for. So Conjure Armor, and we just get full Spectral Armor. And how good is this armor? It's, like, decent. It's like Iron Armor. That doesn't seem fair. And you can keep it, I guess you can keep it in your inventory while it's, while it's going. It looks like. Um, and, uh, so that's pretty sick, I gotta say. And then there's group heal. You know, and I've done that. So, let us get on to the next spells, and that would be... Force Field, Healing Aura, Greater Heal... Say, uh, I don't know how to say that, I'm sorry. Greater Ward. And since we do have seven, let's just go ahead and upgrade the wand just because we can. Um, and we will go Ray of Purification, Remove Court Curse. So we'll take that. And then I think, did that just delete? No, it didn't. Oh my god. Um, I'm not having a good day today. Uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay. And this is gonna go away soon. Uh, so the first one is <laughs> probably the most overpowered spell I've ever seen. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's probably, it, it's, it's the most overpowered spell I've ever seen. You just, you just, you just don't die, you know? You literally don't die. You can walk in and out of this force field. You don't die. 
they expand. Oh, and they expanded the range. Why? It used to be one block wide, and now it's like six. Dude, this is overpowered. I don't think you just remember correctly. Yeah, maybe I'm not. That's okay. Cause watch, if I'm okay, let's say I'm here, right? And I summon in like I just gave myself hunger for like thirty seconds. Um. Okay. So let's say all these zombies are coming at me. They just, they, they, they can't get me. They're burning from the sun. They're not burning from the force field. But there is a charm that does that. And see, they're taking, like, double damage sometimes. And we'll get onto rings later. But, uh, you just don't, you, you don't die. Nothing can come in. No other people can come in. And I'm not sure if spells can, like, affect this ground. If someone were to blow this up, that would be an effective way of getting rid of it. I don't know if that's possible, though. Um, yeah, but that's one of the most overpowered spells. Remove curse, I think, removes curses, I would assume. Removes any curse effect. Okay. Rave purific- Okay. But eight, let's go summon the zombie, because we don't need AI for this. Cha-cha. Six damage a second. It's like just shooting the sun. I like that. I like that a lot. Then there's Greater Ward, which gives Ward 3. Okay, so that's an even better, like, reduces magic damage. So this is pretty cool. Then this, this one, which I'm not sure what it does, which is you. Okay, so it basically makes you not hungry. Um, and then we have... Uh, greater heal, which I'm assuming is going to heal you more. So let's summon in. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna summon in a spider. And we're gonna we're gonna punch you and punch you. No, no, I don't want the dog to. Okay. Well. I'm gonna punch you. Okay. Let's say we're in a bad situation. Oh my gosh, it heals a lot. Okay. How much that did that heal? I think it healed uh five hearts, I wanna say. That's that's overpowered. Okay. Neat. And then there's healing aura, which creates a healing circle on the ground. That you just you, you don't die in. Let's say say there's a oh, you have a hat. I is that an insta regen? I think it is. I think it is an insta regen. Okay. okay now, now you're gonna need to. Where's my. Where's the dog when you need him? My dog died? I think my dog died. No! No dog! Don't die! Um, nope. He not dead. He, he definitely not dead. Um, he's gonna place down another one of these. Oh, there we go. Heals all the way back up. Okay, there we go. And then we are at the last spell. Which is... We've done this one already. Okay. So, that's it. No, we have the master ones. There's even more. This is overpowered. Um, let's get on with the four master spells. Let's see what kind of craziness this is. So we had Iron Flash, and that gave res three. What on earth is this going to give? I'm really not sure. Um, I'm truly scared. Diamond Flash. Resistance four. That is so overpowered. Because look, someone in a spider. Let's just, for example, like. I literally don't take damage. Not wearing any armor. Take not even half a heart. You just go deal with them. Yeah, thanks. Um, that's crazy. Next one is Font of Vitality. Which is like giving yourself an enchanted golden apple. Again, why is this fair? I don't... It, without the... Well, it's not the... Uh, and I don't die from that height. Normally, I would just be dead. Um, so it's not... It doesn't give you the, the res and the fire res, but then you can just... Bam, you have res, you know? Bam, you have the other effects. Except for fire res, which... I mean, you don't super need that. You can just get a ring that... Or some sort of, like, bobble that does that. Font of mana. So let us look at that. 
We were filled with an intense magical energy. Okay. This is a lot of... Okay. Font of Mana 2. I don't know what that does exactly. I'll have to look it up, but I'm not going to do that right now. And the last one is Resurrection. I'm going to assume that this brings things back to life. Let's say... Let's say, uh, let's say you, do I have the right purification still in here? Yes, I do. Now we go to resurrection. Does it bring you back? If I die, does it bring me back? Let's, let's, let's test that. Let's summon a bunch of spiders. I probably should use pigmen, because then they all aggro me. Let's just, let's just die real quick. You know. So if we die... I want to die here. Please tell me I keep inventory. So it did not look like I was um, resurrected. Curse of undeath. Isn't there a, a, a removed curse? There we go. Um, resurrection. I don't know how exactly that works. We will have to... Uh, We'll have to determine what that's like. I'm not entirely sure. In the battle, you will see, I'm sure, what that is like. Um, let us just, let's do, let's do some. Ooh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.